Good morning, my beauty junkies, dolls, and my subbies, my new subbies, too. Welcome to my channel. This is just going to be a start of my makeup. Not a whole finish, but a start of my makeup. Um, this was requested on how I do my eyebrows with an old tube of mascara. So, um, I'm drinking my coffee, getting ready, and I'm going to go ahead and start first. Um, I cleanse my face because I just got out of the shower. Then I am priming my face with um, the e.l.f. Mineral Infused Face Primer. Next, I am using my sponger or whatever it's called. If you, I, I forgot what it's called already. I just got it. And as you see, I applied certain stuff on my face. Woo! Okay, and um, I'm using an N65 by True Match Blend. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this. Evenly on my face. I like this little sponge thing. And you know what? I thought you would just take it out, do whatever, and then start using it. It says that you need to wet it completely with warm water and then drench it or however. Squeeze all the water out, the excess water, and then you can start using it. And then this area right here is to get around your eyes and stuff like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. I'm going to put a little bit more, not much, but just a little bit more. Oh my goodness, I think this is the first how-to I do video with makeup that I'm actually talking. Oh no, is it? I'm not too sure. I can't remember. Now I'm just going to go back and blotch. I figure I'd go ahead and do this part instead of having my face done. So, y'all can just see. And I do swipe all the way down here too, just to make sure everything is blend. I know, I look like a hot mess. It is like 7 o'clock in the morning. 7 o'clock in the morning. going to show you what I do with my eyebrows. Mm. Sorry if you heard me slurping, but the coffee is good. Okay, I'm not going to apply anything else. This mascara is the CoverGirl Lash Blast um, <clears throat> Lux. This is what it looks like, and this is what I use for my eyebrows. Now, I tend to use different ones, but this was the one that I grabbed, and so, yeah. Usually, you when they're on clearance, that means they're semi-old. Most of the time, not all the time, it could be they're just not selling. So, if it is, then go ahead. I tend to get it because um, I get the clearance one because I don't want to spend full price on one and then have to let it sit there and wait. Like these. I wouldn't pay full price on these, not unless they were on clearance. Then I know if it's on clearance, I can go ahead and use it for my eyebrows. Now, this is not the only thing I use for my eyebrow eyebrows. Um, I have an e.l.f. eyebrow pad. I have a um, Chanel eyebrow pad. Um, I have a Fashion Fair eyebrow pencil. I have a clearance. Um, I have all sorts of different ones. I just like to mix it up because sometimes it's hard because my eyebrows, my natural hair color is dark brown black. But my eyebrows are black and <laughs> the rest of my hair is black so sometimes it's hard so for me it's easier to use an old mascara first and then go back over it with a little brown shadow so I'm gonna go ahead and start might not do much talking I'm just gonna kind of follow my eyebrows that's all I'm gonna do sorry my dog is in the background she just ate You see that? That is all I did. Now you see the difference? 
This one's a little darker. I just follow. I don't do much to it. I just add a little bit up there. So when it comes to the powder and pencil, I really don't have to do much. Um, when it comes to eyebrows too, I'm sorry to tell you, but I'm no professional. I'm just telling you how I do it and this is how it works for me. I went and had my eyebrows threaded because I wanted them fixed, well shaped up just a little bit and I'm sorry, but that B-I-T-C-H, I'm not going to say it, but that B-I-T-C-H took half my eyebrows off and I was actually letting my eyebrows go. So guess what? That was $24 she did not get because I walked out an unhappy customer, but it's all right. I mean, I've had them small like this before, but I was just pissed because... I actually let them grow out and then yeah okay oh see now I am just going to go back over them with just this kind of like a mascara brush Dang, are you letting everyone know that food is good? I mean, I'm glad you I'm glad it is good to you. <laughs> okay. Next I am just going to take my F my elf palette like this. Um, it is a light powder, and then this is kind of like a dark brown, but it's like a cream wax. And I'm just gonna take it. I this is an old, um, it's not an old lip brush, but it is considered a lip brush, but for me, it works better. And I'm just going to swipe, swipe, swipe. And then I'm just going to go over my eyebrows just a little bit. Just kind of give it that brown effect now. And it actually holds them in place. Oh, I'm sorry. Unfortunately, I'm not one of the lucky girls that's got a good arch. Well, it was a good arch into that B-I-T-C-H. Sorry, that's a bad word for me to say. That's just, I'm not saying it. I'm spelling it out. Messed up my eyebrows. Just wipe the corners and just put some of this over there. Ta-da! I am good to go. That is all I do to my eyebrows. Like I said, I am not a professional, but that is how I use an old tube of mascara. Just for my eyebrows, just to fill them and then go back in. But um, you can kind of do it however you want to. Like I said, kind of play with it. I've been doing it for a while, so sometimes using it, it might not be so old and dried up and it can go everywhere. But you just got to play with it. Alright my dolls, beauty junkies, subbies. Till next time, peace, love, and happiness. Mwah.